Have you been thinking about moving to Kalamazoo, Michigan? Well, great. This is the video for you. Today, I'm going to give you 10 fun facts about Kalamazoo that will help you fit right on in. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome if it's your first time here. My name is Jasmine Conde, and I'm a realtor out here in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Today, we're going to go over 10 fun facts about Kalamazoo that help you fit right on in. Okay, let's jump right in it. So, the first thing is, get used to the sound of cannonballs. <laughs> I know it sounds funny, but... At the games, all the football games for Western Michigan University, every time we make a touchdown, we hear the nice little poof, poof, cannonball sounds in the background. That's how we know how we're doing at the game. <laughs> Fun fact number two. Kalamazoo didn't always used to be called Kalamazoo. It used to be called Bronson after Titus Bronson, the founder of Kalamazoo. Um, he was later, I guess, chased out of Kalamazoo so after that, um, the community got together and they named the city Kalamazoo. But we still have traces of Bronson around Kalamazoo. We can't just erase it all. Um, we have the hospital downtown. We have Bronson Park, which is right in the heart of downtown. And that's actually where his house used to be. Fun fact number three. Did you know that Kalamazoo is the only place in Michigan that Abraham Lincoln ever visited? I know. How cool, huh? So this was back in, let me see, what was it? 1856. August 27, 1856. And this is before he was even campaigning for himself or running for presidency. So that was the one time that Abraham Lincoln ever visited Michigan, and it was right here in good old Kalamazoo. Next fun fact is we're home to the little yellow checker taxi cab. How cool is that, huh? Next fun fact, we're home to the first outdoor pedestrian mall. So, you know, like a, a outlet mall or um, just not closed in first mall. That's us. We're home to that. Woo, woo. Um, I actually did a video on that. You could click above and you can see that. It's called the Kalamazoo Mall Street, and it's just packed with restaurants and some little shops. But make sure you guys check that out. But one you probably heard already, but Kazoo. So that's short for Kalamazoo. So if you're going to be living here, get used to um, saying, oh, yeah, Kazoo, Kazoo, because Kalamazoo sometimes is a mouthful. And while we're on the note of Kalamazoo being a mouthful, also, get used to people asking you if Kalamazoo is a real place. I get it all the time. I'm like, yep, Kalamazoo is a real place and spell it how it sounds. <laughs> so you may find this one pretty interesting. There's actually no zoo in Kalamazoo. <laughs> yes, we used to have a zoo um, where Millen Park is, but... It shut down and we never got another zoo. So actually the closest zoos are in Bell Creek or in Grand Rapids. <laughs> but we do have an air zoo. <laughs> so if you're going to live here, you're going to hear people talking about the castle, the castle. So you'll see that on um, West Main on the hill. You'll see the castle. And the cool thing about that is... It's actually a bed and breakfast. So you could go in there and enjoy a nice dinner, go on a rooftop and sit in a jacuzzi and enjoy the nice architect of the castle. Did you know that right here was one of the stops in the Underground Railroad? How cool is that? I know you guys been hearing me saying that this whole video, how cool, how cool. But just because I think it's a lot of cool facts about Kalamazoo. <laughs> All right, guys. So the last and final. And I know it's not going to surprise you guys because if you know anything about Kalamazoo, you know that we love our 
beer. We love our beer so much that the colleges here are the first ones to come up with a program for for sustainable craft brewery. Yep. I know that one didn't surprise you, huh? <laughs> All right, guys. I hope you really enjoyed this video. Hope you are prepared for your move to Kalamazoo with these nice 10 fun facts about the area. If you have any questions about anything, don't hesitate to drop them below. And if you are ready for your move, there's a link in the description that you could click on and set up a one-on-one -on -one Zoom call with me so that we can figure out what it is that you are looking for. But that is all that I have right now, guys. Until next time. Bye.